everyone, it's Casey from the Boyd County Public Library and welcome back to our virtual summer reading program. This week I'm going to be showing you how to make wizard wands out of a chopstick, hot glue, and some paint. Be sure to keep logging your hours and stay tuned every Tuesday for a new video. I started off by painting the pointy end of the chopstick brown. You can choose whatever color you want, this is just the one that I chose because I wanted it to look like a real wand. Once I'm done painting that base color on, then we're going to start on the handle. The way I'm showing you how to do the handle today is with hot glue, but you can do it pretty much any way you want to. You can use um, tacky glue. Or you can not use glue at all and use string, thread, embroidery floss, or ribbon. Those are all um, items that I've used personally for wands and they all look really cool. You're basically just going to put layers of hot glue until it gets to the thickness that you think looks best. You can see here that I'm using an old debit card to smooth out the glue. You don't have to do this, but as you can see, mine was dripping. So I did this just to give it a smoother surface. You don't want it to be completely smooth. You want it to have a little bit of texture, but you also don't want it super bumpy. Once that hot glue is dry, I actually added a couple more layers after that last clip, but once it's dry, you're going to paint over it with whatever color you want. I use black because I think that darker colors kind of fill in the gaps a little bit better, but you can use whatever color you want. Sorry the video looks a little weird here, I just could not get my camera to focus. But after you've got the handle painted and it's dry, then you can go in with markers. I use paint markers and draw whatever design you want on the bottom. I did hearts and polka dots. That's pretty much all you need to do to make a really cool wizard wand. If you made one, please leave a picture in the comments below and I'll see you next week.